What is going on, guys? Does Waffle here? The heck is this one? This is new. Unrelenting. Pay more, win more. Five star. Get all the action with clear on the substance. Mobile, 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 VRB17. Will totally blow you away. With over 200,000 combinations of temporary in game purchases. Temporary? Gorgeous. Oh my it's not in the game. Unless you separately purchase each character world element model and texture. Also coming soon. Moba, 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 Mobile FPS MMA IPGAF 4 DHD Double D. The next level in hyper simulated nonsense from Brain Dragon Game. It's not in the game. Oh my gosh. I need to play that on my channel. Anyways, uh, did I even do the intro right there? I don't know. We got interrupted really early on right there, but. Welcome back to some more Journey to the Savage Planet. Last time we left off, we explored more of the elevated realm, and we did that mission where we got the, like, ground pound ability. I think it's called the Stomp Booster, so that's really good. So we actually, uh, yeah, we went over here to the Slam Phibian Pit, which is crazy. Took on some Slam Phibians. We had to, like, shoot their weak spots, and there was, like, a hidden one that was, like, inside of their mouth and stuff like that. Is there going to be more of them over here now that I'm... Yeah, yeah, they're right there, yeah. Cool. Okay, wait, hold on, that's a different... I need to scan that one. It's going to be a part of our, uh, in the world? Why are they, like, going? Oh, there. Stone. Oh, that one's armored. Slamphibian Heath. Ooh, okay. Well, he's, looks like he's aggroing on me or something. Ah, let's get out of there before he starts attacking. Ah, he's already attacking me. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> let's get out of there, but let's just go back. Okay, let's go back to the javelin habitat, at least temporarily, because this episode, what I want to do is continue doing the, the science experiments. We haven't done them in a couple episodes, and I want to try and get to level three. So if we go to, yeah, so we're rank two right now, field explorer. If we go over to, here we are right here. Yeah, so uh, scan 50% of the kindex. Yeah, we're all, wow, we're at 80%, so we're really good on that. Uh, now we need to get, yeah, live samples of a Copiana, we don't know what that is. Jelly Waff, we know where that is. Infected Pufferbird, I know where to find that. So at least we can get two out of three. Maybe we're going to come across the Capiena thing later, or maybe is that in the hidden uh, last teleport of the first area we haven't found yet? I don't know. I guess we'll have to keep our eyes peeled for that because it's not in the Kindex. We already looked at that last episode. And then we also have an experiment here to kill four creatures while they're stuck in the binding bile uh, within three seconds. That should be pretty easy, but at the same time, we might be able to do this one at the same time as this one. Kill three amber armored puffer birds and a single bomb of granite. So I guess we could try that. So we need to get rid of their armor using the blight bomb. And then I, I guess, yeah, just throw a blight bomb and a bomb granite. Maybe get some, uh, what's this stuff called over here? Yeah, grob. Use that to kind of get them all grouped together. And then we just hit them with those both. That'd be really good, you guys. So we could definitely do that. But are we able to do it at the same time as this one? We have to kill four of them while they're stuck in binding. Well, I guess. Yeah, so attract them over with the grob, hit them with the binding bile, and then throw a uh, blight bomb to get rid of their amber, and then a regular bomb grant to actually kill them. So that should be doable. I guess we could try that. So where do we know we could actually get? I think it was in the second area. Was it festering chasm? It might have been. I guess we could try that. Is it? Yeah, because I think right here, this is where we first saw the blight bombs, huh? So this is actually going to be perfect. Yeah, this is perfect. Okay, good. So I think they're over here, aren't they? Yeah, they're right there. Yeah, so we got amber armor, so we got one, two. Now, are the I assume they're also going to be attracted to the uh, to the grob just as much as the railer puffer bird, so I suppose we could try it. So we got two of them right there. And we got two more over here. Okay, perfect. So if I put grob, like, say, right there, and then we put binding bile. So where is it? Okay, so here's binding bile. Here's bait. Just put that right there, trying to attract them over. We got binding bile. We got three of them right there. I guess I'll do that. There you go. So we got binding bile there. Then we'll throw that there. Don't want to do a, uh, uh, that's going to be three of them though, right? It's not going to be all of them. Did I kill them? Oh, we, yeah, we, okay, we got the bomb drop mission done, but there's only three of them there. Man, ah, I tried to do both at the same time. Yeah, that one never came over. Man, should have seen that. Golly. All right, well, uh, what do I need to do for that one? Just, yeah, kill like four of them, four creatures in general using bomb. I guess we could try that. You know what, if we need to kill four things at once, let's just go to the regular area. That way we don't have to worry about the amber armor and whatnot, right? Yeah. Where are we going to go? Meteor Crater? 
Towering crystals. Oh, yeah, yeah, let's do towering crystals. The thing over here. Yeah, we can get the jelly waff too. Yeah, we need to get a live sample of the jelly waff. So this is going to be perfect. Let's get our uh, little. Where's the, yeah, yeah, here we go. We got the live sampler. So we need to take a live sample. Yep, there you go. Uh, jelly waff right there. We also need to get the zombie ones, whatever they're called. Hold on. And. Whoop. Did I miss? Oh, I got him right there. Okay, good. All right, so I'll kill him anyways. <laughs> there you go. So let's see. Where are we going to find puffer? Ah, uh, yeah, we have to go all the way over there, huh? Yeah. Oh, here we go. We got three puffer birds here. So we need to get, what, four? Four creatures together at once, I believe, right? So if I do this, let's go to bait. Go to bait and then put it down. So we get three right here. Where's a fourth creature at? I need to bring another one over here. Can I kick him over here? I, I just don't want to accidentally kill him whenever I'm trying to kick him, right? Oh my gosh, I can hear him screaming in the background. So if I do that, kick him that away. Oh, that's never <laughs> He exploded, he landed on spikes or something there. Golly. Whoopsie daisy. Hold on. Let me find another Puffer Bird. Where'd he go? Okay, so do I need to do anything specific whenever I do this? Do I need to put him in Binding Bile or anything like that? Yeah, so we got the Jelly Waff for that one. Yeah, we do have to do the Binding Bile. Man. So I did all that earlier for nothing. All right, so we got the Binding Bile here. So we got one, two, three. I just need to bring him over here. We already did this in this area before. So we need to get the binding bile now. So we've got three of them right there. We need to we need the alpha to come over here too. Golly, come on. Man! We're just gonna have three of them there? Where's the other one? I saw another one over here. Man, they just ate it. Golly, and they're over here farting and stuff too. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. So one, two, three, and then we got fourth one right there. Okay, good. Let's get some binding bile. And then we use bomb gun. Man, I hit myself. And we use this. To explode them all while they're in the binding bile. Did we get it? Yes, we did. Done. Kill four creatures while they're in uh, binding bile. Okay, good. We got that mission done. Awesome. So we're three out. Of, yep, three out of four right there. Perfect. So we just need to figure out what this other creature is. Get a live sample of it. Is he going to explode? I guess I'll try and kill him anyways. He's going to. There we go. <laughs> and those two giant eyeballs go rolling around too. Anyways, I think up there we can get more uh, bomb grass, but we can get them uh, elsewhere as well. But let's get some grub here. I don't know, maybe I'll keep exploring around this general area. Because I don't think we did too much, especially because this is such an early area anyway, so we're unable to... We didn't have the double jump, we didn't have the triple jump, etc. Right? Oh, stay away from that. So maybe there's going to be an entrance around here or something like that that we missed out on, perhaps? I don't know. Actually, yeah, let's do this. Oh, what in the world? There's... What's that? Orange goo over there by the ship? Huh. I didn't know that. But yeah, uh, if, I, if I keep doing... Oh, and there's orange goo up there too. Okay, cool. But if I keep doing this scan... It's going to show me, like, locations where there's going to be, uh, like, alien alloys or orange goo that's in, like, a new area. Yeah, there's an alien alloy right there. Now, do I need to do anything specific for that? Or is it just down in the open? Or Oh, yeah, yeah, Hold on, yeah. So we've got the tendrils right there. Another one there. Another one up there. Boom! Another alien alloy. Awesome. Oh, man, I just got an achievement. Build it up. Is that for getting a specific amount of alien alloys or something like that? Now, how do we get it? Yeah, how do I get up to there? I don't know, maybe I could launch up to here and then maybe triple jump myself over to there. Whoop. Oh, wow. So if I if I start here, am I able to... Actually, yeah. So if I if I launch myself there and then do a double jump... Oh, I... Yeah, so you're able to do a launch and then do another jump. Yeah, as long as I, I don't use that whole, like, first quadrant right there. It's just I didn't time it just correctly, but it seemed like I'm not going high enough to anyways to go up there, so... Whoop! No, man! Oh, jeez, I even took extra damage here for no reason. Golly, yeah, I don't know how to get that one. Like, all the way up there. We need to have a, uh, actually, yeah, yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. Gelatinous blood, where is that at? Here is right here. If I get one of these, is that going to, Mick? Ah, trip it out! <laughs> we'll put a gelatinous blob right there, get a bounce platform. Is that going to launch me high enough to, ah, it doesn't seem like it. Nah. Well, oh, so if I do, actually, yeah, what if I stomp on it, too? So if I launch myself and then stomp, Jeez, that kills the entire gelatinous blob, which is just a bunch of eggs. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> well, we got jelly waff right there, but it looks like 40 meters that way. It looks like there's orange goo like hidden over here. Is this another area? Oh, it's just behind some uh, some slappable plants. <laughs> it seems like it. Yeah, it's not like it. Yeah, it's right there. Cool. Yeah, I wouldn't have seen that. Yeah, we got 58 of those now. Wouldn't have seen that at all if I didn't have this uh, teleport thing, but we do. Have a looks like an anchor point right there. Loop, and then loop, and then now we're up here. Wow. So now where? 54 meters that away. Wait, where is that? So that, is that one of the secrets? That is telling me about whenever I'm in this general area, perhaps? There's 40, 444 that away. 
All the way down. Yeah, it's all the way down there. Now, I wonder. I don't think there's anything in this first area. Oh, gosh. Break my fall. Oh, my gosh. 14 meters out of way. 130 something meters. Where is this? Because right here, yeah, we, we've seen this before. We unlocked it. We had a thing right there. We had to feed. Yeah, there's an orange goo, like, re remnants, I guess you could say there. Okay, so it seems like it's pretty close to whatever that teleport is. Okay, so it looks like... Oh, this one's hidden in some of the tall, slappable grass, too. There you go. Cool. So that was close to this teleport. Ooh, so it seems like there's another one over there. 68 meters. Oh, yeah, I'm, like, right on track with this. Where's this at? Must have missed out on this, too. I wonder if it's going to take us any closer to that one that's, like... Yeah, 72 meters right below us. What is this? The heck? Oh, whoops! I accidentally just threw a thing on it. What the... Is that a... Is that a slime? Where'd it go? Oh, it's down there now. I need, I need to scan that. Is that one of the new... The thing I need to scan? Hold on. Oh, gosh! The blobby part seems impervious to damage, but there's definitely something trapped inside. Osmotic cube. Primordial blob. Oh, man, this guy's killing me now. Okay. Trying. Oh, yeah, let's get... Let's use the environment to kind of block his hits. Oh, there you go. I got it. Oh, wait, no, I didn't. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, he's attacking, and I'm reloading right now. And the other one in the background is trying to get me. There you go, and then he's vulnerable now. There you go, one side down. Oh, man, where's the other one at? Oh, my gosh. Okay, he's rolling, and he's ready to die. There you go, he's down. This one going to come towards me now? Yes. And, oh, oh man, I went straight into him right there, <laughs> foolishly. <laughs> hold on. Oh, go, 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 go. Oh, my, oh, he anticipated me, but I didn't move far to the left far enough. We still got him there in the end. Okay, good. But where did that cube guy go? He's over there. Yeah, odds mod a cube. What did it say about him? Primordial blob monster known to bend shiny things left lying around. Yeah. So how do I break him open? Just shoot? No. How do I break him open? Blob monster used a bend shiny. Is there another shiny? I, I didn't hear whatever her name was. <laughs> Echo, Echo or Eco or whatever her name is. I don't know what she said a minute ago. Is there another thing I could use to... I don't know, bomb a granite, use a bomb against him. Is that going to work? He's impervious to bombs. What? How? The heck? He's just a little slime cube guy. What in the... How do you... Let's, let's open up the Kinder... Kin, kindex, not Kindrex. Uh, Kinte, I, I guess it's a creature? I guess it's a prey? I don't know what it is. How <laughs> it is? I was not a cube. Yeech, this gelatinous green cube seems to comprise a mishmash of countless material elements, as if some sort of primordial ooze of this planet decided, nah, I'm good like this, and stubbornly maintained its form through millennia. Five bucks if you lick it. Uh, but how do, how do I kill it? I don't know. Oh, it just shows like a screenshot of it right there. Okay. Huh. Well, I don't need a live sample of that thing. I need of something else. But I'm curious. Is this going to do? I, I doubt. Yeah, it's just saying, yeah, stop or whatever. Is there any? Oh, shock fruit, maybe? Let's try this. That didn't do a thing, probably because he's in water. I don't know. Actually, wouldn't be in the water. Actually, yeah, let's try blind bomb next. That didn't do anything either. What the heck? How do you get this guy open? What if I bounce on him? Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah, let's try a new smashing ability. That didn't do anything either. What in the world? He's just a little jello cube and he's like impervious to everything. What? My gosh. Oh, wait, hold on. There's an orange goo all the way over there. Okay, that should be easy to get, but this guy's certainly not easy. I don't know how to break him open, but at least he's in this nice big wide open area. We could easily uh, find him again, but how do we get to this alien alloy that's 25 meters below me? Where it doesn't seem like there's like a secret entrance behind the waterfall or... I'm like, we're behind the waterfall, but there's nothing back here. And hey, we got another orange goo there. Yeah, we got a secret nearby. It's telling me about a secret nearby. So I wonder what that is. Is it that one that's like right there? Nah. Okay, so it seems like there's some orange goo. Perhaps in that cave where that guy is with the... You just have to walk up to him and like slap him or whatever. Or poke him in the eye. So I wonder if we go back into that cave, we might be able to get a... Another orange goo. And if that's maybe where the other alien alloy is hiding out at. Okay, let's try that. Oh, wait, hold on. Looks like there's some orange goo over there. Hold on. Slap this guy. Blip, blip, and kill him. So there's orange goo here that's underneath. Where is that? 
Oh my god, what? I've been walking past this. How many times have I walked past this? And there's an orange goo there the whole time and we got Lola. And there's another one. All the way over here, which is also, I guess, hidden in some tall grass. Tall slab of right? Yep. Just like I thought. Man. How's this stuff able to hide so well? Now we get 61 of these things. That's crazy, you guys. Anyways, yeah, let's go back to that guy where you have to poke him in the eye and whatnot and see if we could find orange goo in there and maybe an alien alloy, too. Oh, here he is. Whoa, is he going to attack? Okay, so it seems like... Ooh. Just wait. And then... Okay. Do you want to turn? Okay, let's go, 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 go. Oh, my gosh. Does he know? Do you see me? Seems like he's looking, like, right at me, though. Okay. Ooh, I think we're good. I think we're good. Oh, poke him in the eye! Bloop! <laughs> there you get a little bit of silicon for that, too. Oh, wow, and a bunch of silicon, a bunch of carbon from that, too. So where is... 72 meters that away? Oh, I bet. Wasn't there an area in here that we... We saw, but there was, like, nothing there? I bet it's in that area. And because we have the double jump, triple jump, etc. Just ignore these flying bat guys for right now, though. I bet it's in that area that we kind of ignored. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, it's right here. Like, we saw these guys, like, flying around, and I was like, what is even in here? Is there anything even worth it? But because we didn't have... Wow, it's, like, kind of in a corner, it looks like. Hold on. Oh, yeah, right there. We got some, like, cave... Po oh, no! I'm in the lava, man! Oh, the platform went away! <laughs> I lost, like, no health right there, too, by the way. Golly. But there we go, 62! Man! And we got some vitality right here, which I could definitely use. There we go. Thank you very much. Where are the, uh, okay, there's the bad guy. You can only hit him whenever he's moving. And all of his materials are going into the heckin' lava. Oh, wait, no, I could, oh! Oh, I got him again when he went in, uh, midair right there. Okay, yeah. So see if we're suctioning these all up while I'm on top of this platform. But we'll land on top of this platform. No! I tried to jump backwards and I overjumped. <laughs> okay, well, at least we got that one right there, but... Is there an alien alloy around here? 130, 140... I don't think so. But anyways, yeah, let, let me keep exploring around, roaming around this first area. And I'll let you guys know if I... Oh, whoa, there's orange goo up there. Wait, didn't I have the orange goo upgrade whenever we're exploring that? Or I, I guess, yeah, we got it later that episode, right? Yeah. So where is that? I guess I'll grab that real quick and then we'll... Oh, man, I'm getting porcupined over here. <laughs> Need to watch out for them, but... Man, how, how do we miss out on a whole entire creature, like a green slime creature this whole time in this first area? Episode, what is this? Episode 10, we're only now finding out those guys even existed. Golly. Let's figure out where this... Okay, 41 meters. Oh, hold on. I think I see it. I think you have to, like, jump up here. Do a little bit of blip. Oh, there? Yeah, look at that. It's super hidden. Man, how would anyone see that thing without the little HUD upgrade? That's crazy. And that one's 146. I don't know where that would be, necessarily. I can make it up here. Oh! Oh, I kind of did. Whoa! Give me a double jump. Oh, there we go. My oh, ah! oh! Oh, there we go. Yeah, I made it up here. <laughs> Actually, let me look behind these waterfalls. Whoa! Oh my gosh! There is a secret area behind these waterfalls. Do I still have a shock fruit? I do. I have one left. So let's use it here. Whoops! That was the wrong button. Keep the door open. Oh! Oh my gosh! Plork's vertical corridor. Is this another teleport area? I think we found a super duper secret area here, you guys. Oh my god, whoa. Like I didn't, oh, oh, oh we're about to get pushed, ooh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, make it up, make it up, make it up, ah! Oh man, this is gonna be kinda tough. Man, I'm glad we had that last shock fruit right there though, you guys, that was crazy. Oh no, I'm falling off. Ooh. Okay, so how, how, how in the, so I have to, I have to make sure I get flung off of this. Launch up this, wrap onto the edge, no! Man! Ah, okay, okay, there's no hook shots there, I don't believe, right? Oh man, <laughs> hit my head on that, bonk myself. Come on, there we go. And then this, let's get on the other side. Okay, let's try and... Whoop, there we go. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, I made it, I made it. What was this place called again, by the way? Is this the secret that it's been telling me about? I feel like it is. Man, I found this thing, like, completely accidentally. Like, at the last second, I was like, oh, man, is there something behind the waterfall over here, though? I'm glad I checked. Let's see if I could... Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, man. 
Okay, this is really tough to try and... Whoa. Oh, you have to go up really high right there. Oh, don't fall off, don't fall off. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Yeah, I don't think... There, there, there's no... There's nothing for me to grab onto up there. Nothing to hook shot up there, it seems. Golly. Whoa. No, man. Oh, I'm falling. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. I'm falling again. No. Oh, yeah. Okay. So it seems like advanced launch boosters. Yeah, I need to be ranked three. And then quadruple thrusters. We need to be ranked three, too. Yeah. I don't think faster refuel. Yeah, I'm like... it. Refuel is pretty fast already, so it's not that big of a deal. But we need to get ranked three here, and we're still doing these experiments. We need to... Okay, let's go get infected pufferbird. Don't know where this heckin' Capienna thing is. I don't know if I'm going to be able to look it up either, because this game doesn't really have that comprehensive a uh, wiki, but... If, if it comes down to it, I might have to look it up, you guys, but I definitely want to get it done at least this episode. Because we're doing a bunch of exploring right now, but... Speaking of such, yeah, I'm, I guess I'm glad we found that. Holy heck, that was really good there, you guys. Let's actually go back to the Chaplain. I haven't been there in a little while. Drop off some of the materials we got. There you go, resource deposited. And an alien alloy, too. Good. I don't think there's anything I can upgrade, though. I think we already checked that. Yeah, there's nothing here I can upgrade. At least yet. What's happening here? Oh, yeah, we already we saw that we like weird thing. We saw that last episode. I guess I have a full thing of grub, too. That's good. But let's go to... Where is that second area? Itching Fields. Fungi of Cyanid? Was it this? Hold on. Let's go to this. Fungi... Yeah, yeah, yeah I think so. So if this is where I think it is, we just need to kind of drop below because we got out of a cave and that's how we got this teleport, right? Yeah. And that cave has those infected. So we got regular puffer birds here. Let's see if there's any. Uh, oh, wow. There's a, there's a green. Man, I almost got a green goo. Orange goo that away. Can I make it over there? Hold on. Whoop. And then triple jump. Seems like. Oh, yep. It's like right there, right behind some slappable grass again. Holy heck. And look at my periphery, too. I got a bunch of orange, orange goo around here. One there, 44 meters there. Another one there, there's like three there. There's, man, this second area. We haven't explored this second area at all, you guys. There's so much orange goo around here, it's crazy. Now, how do I get that one that's like 50 something meters away now? It seems like I'm relatively close enough to it. Where is that? Oh, it seems like I have to go up a little bit more, okay. And then there's also an alien alloy there, but I don't get, okay, it looks like I have to do a rail to go over there. Is there a way? Oh, whoa. Oh, is that guy down there? Yeah, we never went over there, did we? Yeah, so we could definitely uh, go down there and get something, but it seems like we need to kind of ascend a little bit more, I guess. Maybe go up top of those mushroom things, perhaps? But right now, let's go get a live sample of these. Are those the infected ones in the water right there, or are those regular ones? Okay, these are cave ones, yeah. We need to go down a little bit deeper. Oh, yeah, and then there's a shock fruit area down there, too, I remember. But we don't have any shock fruit right now. Should we go get some real quick? Let's go get some real quick. Because there's a teleport somewhere around here where there's a shock fruit tree like right outside the teleport. Let's go get that real quick in the third area. Elevated realm. That's what it's called. Oh, yeah. It was the one at the very end. Yeah. Crackling, cracking pedestal, whatever it's called. Yeah. And yeah, there's another area here. Yeah. I guess I'd hate to do it. If I were in the area, we can go unlock that last teleport. But I guess maybe. That's like a whole area there. I feel like that's like a whole episode worth of stuff. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> You know, but there's a lot of shock fruit plants over here and oh, yeah, there are infected. Well, there were, but they're not here anymore. So I feel like because we defended that shock fruit plant, there are no more infected puffer birds trying to like, take it down plants versus zombie style, you know, <laughs> get some uh, shock fruit right there. Perfect. We got five of those. I just want to make sure we only got four. OK, let's grab there. You go. Inventory full. Of those. OK, good. So let's go back to that puffer bird cave. Try and get an infected puffer bird and use this shock fruit to go in that area where we were unable to go there previously because we didn't have shock fruit yet. Oh, speaking of shock fruit, I don't know what that is back there. I'm using my scanner, nothing's saying anything. But I just went up there to get some silicon. How do I triple jump, maybe? I don't know. I'm, I feel like I might need quadruple jump. And then I need a shock fruit to kind of keep that thing open. But there's like no like hook shot or anything you know i just feel like that's way too far away and there's no hook shot for me to to secure my landing but i'll try it one two yeah we definitely need quadruple jump you guys <laughs> golly save me cartographer Woo, there you go yeah that's got to be what that secret is nearby that's talking about right there i'll see you later cartographer maybe later this episode i don't know all right, you guys are back. Uh, let's jump down. Now that we have the shock fruit, we're able to get uh, into that area. And I wonder if that area has... No, I think I think right before that area has the uh, infected puffer burst. So we don't have to worry about them being in that area, right? 
So if we get a little bit deeper, we still have cave puffer birds here, but if we get down- Yeah! I think one just spawned in a second ago. Yeah, all the way down there! Oh man, what the- Oh, we got the puff- or uh- are these the Yeah, they're the tongue guys phasing in and out of reality! There we go. Is that all of them? Oh, we got a- uh, something right there. What's over here? Oh, we got more of them over there. Okay. So let's go to- Where is it? The heck is happening right now? Why am I not able to switch my- The heck? Uh... I'm not able to switch grob there for some reason, you guys. I don't know what happened there. Oh. Okay, I think it fixed itself there. Now I'm able to use the live sampler again. I don't know what was going on there, you guys. I couldn't switch the, uh, the, the, the tool in my left hand for some strange reason. But down there, yeah, we got infected puffer birds. But can I get close enough to actually... Oh! Come on, come on, come on! Why is it not working? Oh my gosh! Now I can switch them, but I can't, I can't use the actual thing. I don't know. I feel like... I, oh, here we go. Yes! Hit him! I'm hitting the button! Oh, there we go! It finally worked! Okay, those guys must be really tough to try and scan before they can, like, self-destruct or whatever. Whoa, there's three- there's one orange goo there, one there- where is that? Wow, that's like a bunch of them just, like, right next to each other right there, you guys. Holy heck. But I think down here, where was it? Yeah, you know, secret nearby. Yeah, right here. So if we get the- get this. Man, I'm getting killed by the tongue guys, most likely. There you go. This is not- oh my gosh, this is another laser area! Plork's narrow narrows of despair. What was that a grapple? Yeah, a grapple hook right there. But what do I? Is there? A, I don't think there's any grapple uh, grapple seed places. Oh, there's a thing. There we go. Shot it. Killed it. Okay, good. Just there was nothing trying to kill me. But so he's come out. Okay, so I kind of see. But where do we go after that? Oh, but there's like a wall in the way. Oh wait. Oh, we go to that side. Okay. So let's try this. Now with triple jump, this should be a lot easier than it would have been normally. Okay, so it looks like we go to that side whenever it starts moving. Whoa, whoa, there you go. Then do we go out to that side next? Or... What happens? I don't know! I don't know! I don't know! My gosh! Whoa, 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 what? What? I'm kind of like glitched right here. <laughs> How in the world? No! Oh my gosh. Ooh, <laughs> I'm stuck right here. Oh, okay, let's just fall. Oh! My gosh, we're taking damage. Yeah, from down here, we could probably get a good sense of, like, where we go. So we could start out there, who's out, and then we go there, and then from there, we jump to there. But where do we go from there? So that goes out, but then that goes... Do we have to go jump there, and then jump there between all the... Oh, we might have to. Oh, that's going to be tough. Holy heck. I'm like, I'll try it, but I'm almost heckin' dead, so I need to get a... Okay, so go here, we go here, there we go, then, yeah, okay, so let's try that, okay, so now it's moving, so I think, what, well, yeah, so we have to go here, and when it starts moving, oh, oh my god, I'm making it now, oh my gosh, we almost made it there, but I have to go like around corners and stuff, it's crazy, I need to get some vitality though, but let's see if we, okay, we have another shock fruit, so we can go back inside there, so that's good, but, where are the vitality plants at? Wait, hold on. Seems like. Yeah, here we go. We got one right here. Wait, what in the world? Do I have to crawl into Okay, I do. That's kind of weird. So we got an orange goo right there. Is there another one around here? Hold on. That was one like 19. How do, how do I get to that one that's like below me now? Yeah, if we keep going this way, we can find some vitality finally. So that's good. Let's see if we can find that orange goo that is supposedly 35 meters there. Is that on the Oh, wait, no. Oh, here we go. We got a secret. Yeah, there it is. Oh, that was super duper hidden, you guys. I would not have seen that. And I didn't see it last time we are here. So that just goes to show how uh, hidden that is, right? So there you go. Awesome. Not quite full health, but eh. It's a lot better than we were a minute ago. And we're going to be losing a lot of health down here, I'm sure. Like that, golly. And then, uh, lip. So there it goes. Now that's staying open. So let's see. Let's wait till this comes out. There you go. Then... I guess, yeah, you know what, from here, we can just go, yeah, that. Oh! Yeah, you know what, we can just take some damage like that, it's not that big of a deal. Oh! Oh my gosh, we made it! How? It's gonna come out, okay, good. Can I just take damage from this? Is that gonna, oh! Alien ally, boom! Just go all the way through it, take a little bit of damage, and boom! <laughs> now, can I scan this thing? Is this a, yeah, it is a thing I have to scan, it's a uh, note or whatever. Yeah, explorer's log. Seems to be an exploration log of an unknown alien species. Yeah, so, uh, I think it wasn't, like, another space program, because we're fourth best or whatever. And they're giving me a bunch of, uh, materials back here, which is good. So it seems like, yeah, th 
whatever that area was, now he's just like go up vertically. Seems like there's an alien alloy there, maybe? But didn't we scan, but there's nothing over there? I don't know. I don't know what would be hidden back there, honestly. But at least we got an alien alloy there. So from here, do we just fall down purposely or, or what? Uh, but yeah, I, I think. Wait, is this never going to turn off? What? Does it force you to take damage? Because it doesn't turn off. Yeah, I, I think so. Or maybe you can go. No, I, I think you take damage no matter what. You can't like go. What? I tried to jump right there to break my fall. <laughs> but now we're back uh, low health, unfortunately. But yeah, we might end the episode off right here, you guys. At least we got the loot that was inside of here. There's nothing else. Yeah, there's nothing else. So that was relatively easy, especially whenever I realized, yeah, you know what? Let's just take a little bit of damage, go through the lasers, not really wait on them, right? That seemed to work out quite well. I don't know where to go from here. I think if I go this way, isn't this gonna... Yes, that's where the first area was. Or the first zombie puffer birds were. I think if we go this way a little bit more, we can find... Yes, yeah, so there's a teleport down there and a bunch of vitality plants, which is great. Awesome. Okay, so I guess we'll go back to the ship, drop off that alien alloy we got right there, and... At least we made some good progress, but I still don't know what this Capienna thing- Should I look it up real quick? Just so we can end off the episode with a little bit of progress of us figuring out where this thing is. Or is that going to be like super duper late game? I don't know. Now there was one thing, kind of like a Slamphibian, kind of like the Pike Mander, where I didn't scan it. So I, I need to figure out where that was. Maybe is that the Capienna? Maybe. And if so, can I even find it again? Right, let, me, let me go look it up real quick. See if there's anything online about it. Oh, I think so. Yeah, I, I looking at this thing, didn't we battle this? I'll, I'll show a picture of it on screen. I feel like we battled it during one of the third teleport. I, I just don't know if I if I go back there, is it going to have that battle again? I think it was third area. It was the repaired. Yeah, repaired teleporter. But it, it's just a regular teleporter now, isn't it? So I'm not able to get a sample from it unless can I go to that area again or I don't know, because it. Yeah, I remember this and then I activated it and it teleported us in the sky like five times. I just need to figure out where that was. Oh, it looks like we got a little bit of silicon right here. Hold on. Lip. And it looked like... Yeah, okay, so let's go to... We need to use... Oh, we haven't used this in a while to explode, like, fake walls like that. Is there going to be more like that around here? I don't know. Wait, what? Oh, it's just orange goo. Okay. I guess I'll grab that. Blip. And I guess it was some sort of material there as well, as well as a seed pod. I feel, I, I feel like I have to go up there somehow. But is there even a way up there? I don't know. Oh, wow, so now I'm up here. There's a lot of this, like, silicon and, and shock fruit around here, too. I might as well get some more shock fruit, but I, I guess I'll grab the silicon. Or, uh, whatever that is. Oh, there we go. Orange goo. Grab that. And I... I need to figure out how to get... Because it was, like, two episodes ago or whatever it was, wasn't it? Or, or maybe I could find them over there. Are they going to be, like, out in the wild now? Or... Oh, alien alloy. I wonder if that gets activated by uh, defeating one of those guys. But, I don't know, we got these little, little... Oh! Hold on, where's the whack-a-mole guy? Oh, there we go. Try and kill them all before they kill me, because I'm almost like a dead. Oh, my gosh. Oh, there we go. Got him. Okay, let's reload. And we're already reloading. Inside. Oh, ah, man. Is this last one going to be... There he is. Got him. Nice. Yeah, so we got an alien alloy over there. I wonder how you activate it. You have to activate it by killing the... Well, we, we just need to get the bomb grants for that, right? What is this? Does this take us anywhere? a grapple hook, but for what? Ooh, hold on. We gotta see. Is there anything back there? What's this? Oh, so what? The, okay, the, I, I don't know what the point of that was, but <laughs> I guess that's good. It just takes us to the other side of the teleporter. Yeah, so I think over there is where all that battling took place. We got an alien alloy over there, but what do I do here? Is this the one that you have to shoot the tendrils or whatever again? I feel like it might be. Oh, here we go. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Uh, so we need to get, what's it called? Light bombs. We need to put it here. Get rid of that amber. Is it going to be a tendril under that? I feel like it would be. Yep. Okay, so we got to shoot the tendrils. Oh, there's another one up there. Whoops. Where's the last one at? So we got three tendrils. Seems like it's... Oh, is it over there? Hold on. Whoop. Whoop. Let me land. Oh! Is it over here? I don't see it. Oh, is it? Oh, I think it is. Oh, that's why they have that. The last tendrils down. Ah! Oh, I got it, man. Holy heck. <laughs> All right, let's get the grapple seat. Let's get out of here. So that's why you have that random thing right there. That makes sense. Then you uh, hook back to this. There we go. And then we get the alien alloy. Perfect. But is there a Capiana creature around here? Oh, yeah. Look at this. We got rails here. Another rail here. Surely it's not just a bunch of puffer birds covered in amber. 
I guess. Oh, oh, we got another area we could explode right there with bomb grenades. Wow. Yeah, I probably missed out on a bunch of those, huh? Oof, there's, whoops, didn't mean to do that. Just back. What's back there? Wait, what is that? Oh, it's a thing you have to stomp. Yeah, and then there's orange goo under there, it looks like. So, whoops. Uh, whoop. There you go. Oh, I have to use... Man, light bulb. At least I have them, right? So, there you go. It's the orange goo's under that... That amber. Yep, it is. Okay, good. So let's grab that. What's that? 63, 69. Whoa, how many, how did I get up to almost 70 already? Man, that's crazy. We made some great pro. We got like 10 this episode, you guys. That was awesome. All right, well, didn't find the Capiana thing yet, but I know what it looks like. Uh, let, let, let me pull up that page again and see if it's going to tell me where I could find it or if it's only available in that one area during that one instance. I hope not. So I pulled up a, a thing that says the Capiana could be found at the Fungi of Cyanid 7 in the Itching Fields and the Infernal Cauldron in the Elevated Realm. So Infernal Cauldron, is that the lava area? That last area we haven't unlocked. It sounds like it because that name doesn't sound familiar at all. So I guess that means, yeah, let's let's finally go unlock this. So we need to go to, what's it called? The Repaired, whatever it's called. No, wait, no, this is the Repaired one. Let me get some bomb guns too, by the way, because we just used a few of them. Did I ever scan this, by the way? I did. Okay. I didn't scan the Blight Bomb uh, Shrine, though. So I need to go figure out where that is, and that's going to help us out a little bit. But where do I go from here to get back to... I don't know if there's a thing I could jump on top of or what, but... Whoop, go on top of the shrine. And it looked like from a distance there was like a way for me to swing. Wait, yeah, how, how do you get over there from here? We know it's all the way over there, it looks like. Wait, huh? Oh, I think... Oh, okay. You guys remember there was a teleport with, like, a tree that looked like it was made out of, like, marshmallows on sticks? I think that's how we get over there. I must... Maybe the angle we're looking at from over there, it looked like we had to start from here to go over there, but no. We have to go where that, like, tree... I, I think that's next to a teleport. Yeah, so... It only makes sense that it starts... Oh, no, we got it. Yeah, we got to stomp thing here. Yeah, we never, uh, we never did this yet. Since we got the, uh, ability. Let's just go. Oh, it's just more uh, stuff. Okay, so we get uh, some silicone or silicon. It's a completely different thing, by the way. <laughs> and we got 70 orange goo now, so that's good. Is there anything else around here, though? Like in my vicinity? Like while I'm here, is there any 131 that away? 61 meters that away, though. That might be worth it trying to get that. Especially because we're making it. Yeah, it seems like it's on the same area that I'm on right now. Now, is that in another hidden area where we have to stomp, but we're unable to do it until now? Or maybe, yeah, maybe a shock fruit, because there's a shock fruit tree right there. Where is this? Yeah, 13. Okay, it's on the other. Whoa, look at that. We got a rainbow. Is that symbolic of something? Or is it because there's a waterfall here? I don't know. But look at that, you guys. We got a cute little rainbow there. <laughs> so where is that? Yeah, 18 meters in here. I feel like it's either like a bro or a... Yeah, that's a shock fruit thing. Okay, I was about to say like maybe one of those walls you have to use the bomb grant for, but no. So this would be... Yeah, use it right here. It's open. There it goes, still open, and let's grab that seed bag, let's grab some carbon, and orange goo, number 71! Man, that's crazy! Let's go over there where that marshmallow thing is, though. <laughs> we can get started uh, heading towards this last area where, supposedly, there are the Capiana things, but there's also a Capiana, apparently, in that second area, the Itching Fields area. Oh, we got these things, hold on. I need to make sure these things don't distract me, whatever I'm trying to, like, parkour. There you go, kill that. Get this one. Kill it! Got it! Nice! Anything hidden here, by the way? Another orange goo hidden here? I don't think so. <laughs> oh, another one! Got it! Awesome! Yeah, see so here, we got the marshmallow guy again, so... It seems like, yeah, we just hookshot... Over to here? And, oh, another hookshot! Whoop! Now, what is that? Is that just... Roasting a marshmallow or whatever? <laughs> I guess it is. Yeah, mallow sap, that's what it's called. There's nothing else here. Oh, we got a rail. Okay, here we go. Ride this. Then we go on to the hookshot. Whoop! Oh, wait, no, that's another rail. Here's a regular hook shot right there. Another hook shot right here. Whoop! And another one! Area discovered the Infernal Cauldron. That's what it's... Yep, that's what I just read. Infernal Cauldron, so... I think there are going to be Capianas around here, you guys. Let's get our uh, live sampler out. Let's get ready to sample them. And up there is the teleport, so... How do we ascend? I guess, yeah, up here. Looks like this way ascends, so... By the way, anything new I can scan here? Immediately? Alien teleportation pedestal. Yeah, we already know that, but... We're heading up there. We just need to... So you're clear of the lava while it's still in lava form. There you go. And we got armored uh, puffer birds over here. Don't need to worry about them too much. Is there anything new yet? Doesn't seem like it. I haven't come across the Capiana things yet. It seems. Oh, am I on top of lava right now? It's killing me. It looked like it was cooled. Okay, we got an alpha. 
hoverboard right there. Seems like we still need to head up that way. Oh wait, is this it? Is this like a battlefield for those guys? I think it is. Kind of like the uh, the Slamphibian area. It was like a Slamphibian battlefield. Are they going to spawn in here? What? Because this is crazy. There's like lava appearing all over the place right now. I don't see anything right now. Oh, Black Bomb. I don't know if I need that for anything right now. Although it's kind of giving it to me right there, kind of symbolizing you might need this, right? So, <laughs> might need to grab them because I, I do have only a few of them in my inventory. I just said I only had like three of them, right? So, let's make sure we're full on that. But I guess we keep going. Yeah, because that goes down. I guess we keep ascending this way or. Oh, grab the edge. Oh, there we go. Perfect. And look. Is there any other way up here other than just climb it up like that? I guess not, but there you go. Activated teleport, didn't even need to fight anything. Cool. We start the entire alien. Yeah, we got 17 now, 20 teleports right there, you guys. Amazing. And I think that's all of them in the elevated realm, right? Yeah. Look at this. Awesome. In Infernal Cauldron. Cool. So we still need to get one right there, but it also said I had 17, so that would be 18, and I guess there's two more somewhere? Is there like a last fourth area where there's like a couple more teleports? Maybe. But apparently, according to that thing I read, there's more of those guys around. Whoa, something's exp Oh, I guess I was just an alpha puffer bird that like killed itself right there. I don't know why. Doesn't seem like there's any uh, enemies around here that would be trying to damage it, right? I can see. Oh wait, it probably, yeah, okay, it probably took, yep, just like that. <laughs> it's taking damage from the lava. Let's watch out for that, make sure we don't take damage from it, too. Like I did right there, literally, but... If I jump into here, is this going to spawn in the uh, Capiana thing? Let's see. Now we're down here. Oh! oh. Okay, yeah, we got Alien Alloy, uh, Voldivore right there, so it's probably... When I get close to this, it's probably going to be... Yep, it's closing! And we got Capiana, right? Where is it? I need to get a live sample. I need to... Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is! Get a sample! Get a sample! Get a sample! Boom, we got it! Awesome, so how do I... Yeah, yeah, he's got little, little tendrils, and let's scan him. It's got little tendrils we need to shoot. Awesome. Yes. It seems to have its on the tip of its tail. If I were going to shoot it, I'd shoot it there. Wait, what? Good work. I am compressing and transmitting your data to Kindred HQ. I got it. Now, what was on the tip of its tail that she said right there? I hope it wasn't anything uh, demonetizable, but <laughs> I, I feel, oh, is there another one? I feel like there is. I think there's, yep, there's another one right there. So that was a widow. Is this a w widower? Whatever the male version of widow is, I forget what that. I, I think it's that word, right? Oh, oh Jesus! Ah! Oh, I think I think there's amber on the end of it. Yeah, just like the desert uh, pike mander guy. Hold on, vitality plant, perfect. Just like him, we need to get rid of the protective amber around that. Then he'll be vulnerable, right? Yeah, there he is, right there. Oh, he's teleporting though, but oh, there you go. Okay, he's 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 vulnerable. Shoot the little tendrils there, man. Uh, but I'm on low health right now, so I need to... He's moving around really fast, and he's able to teleport. I think I got one right there, but man, there's lava everywhere. Oh, there we go. Vitality plant over there. Let's go grab it, and uh, I guess we can get some blight bombs, too, it looks like. Relatively safe area. Let's grab some right there. Boom. That's empty. Where is he? There he is. Is it the same one? I think it is. Okay, we got... There we go. We got him. He's down. That's good. Is that all of them? Is the Vault of War going to... We'll have to take on... I think I have to take on two of them at once, you guys. It's still not... Oh, yep. Looks like there's two enemies. Looks like... Is there three? No, it's just two. Yep. Okay, we got a male and a female, it seems like. There you go. Oh, one of them, one of them got hit by that. But the other one, yeah, that one's still covered in uh, amber, unfortunately. Man, I'm trying to spam like crazy. I missed. There we go, there we go. He's, he's, he's vulnerable, that's good, but I need to get some vitality. Get a little bit of health, because there's two of them right there, but at least we did a good job getting rid of his amber on his protective, uh, whatever that is. I don't need, oh man, it didn't respawn yet. I need to get on the other side. The heck is he doing? He's in the lava. <laughs> Need those tendrils to get hit by the lava, take some damage, but I think I got one of them, so that's good. We get the female that's always like exposed tendrils or whatever, right? There. Oh, no, no, no! Ah, the heck? What in the. Ah, I'm taking way too much of damage. Oh, let's go get some vitality over the. Oh, vitality right here, too. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Man, they're moving around super duper fast. Ah, they're pushing me in the lava, too! Vitality. Let's grab it, good. Yeah, they're just hanging out in the lava like it's nothing. It's crazy. Let's get some, yeah, you know what, yeah, let's get some biny bile. I don't know, is Grob gonna attract him too? I don't know. So up there, it's a vitality. I don't think so, I don't think they like Grob, honestly. <laughs> biny bile, let's use that here in just a sec. Yeah, here we go. Throw it there, as long as he doesn't teleport. There he goes, so the, the male, oh, I think they're both hit? Are they both hit? I don't think so. I think the one on the, I think that one's hit, but the other one's teleporting around me, I feel like. There he goes, so we got that one, I think that's the female, right? Where's the other one, there he is. 
I missed. Whoop. Man, I was anticipating him right there. Okay, he got hit by the button. What? He teleported away! Hacks have been enabled! Oh, we got him, though! We got him! Is the Vault of Ford opening? Or is there more? I feel like there's more. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, I think it did open. Okay, that's good. I was about to say. Usually it's like three waves, like one and then another, and then you take on both at the same time, like the, the Slamphibians. So I, I think we got it there, you guys. So I think we just need to head back to the ship and we officially level up to level three explorer or whatever, right? Boom! Alien Alloy, 19 out of 32 there. Really great progress. Let's get a little bit of health right here, full health. Boom! Awesome, holy heck. That was some great exploration this episode, you guys. Found a bunch of, or like these last two. I, I feel like I'm splitting this up in the multiple episodes, honestly. <laughs> Just because I'm exploring so much, it just depends on how much stuff I cut out of the videos and whatnot, but holy heck, we got so many orange goo, we got few alien alloys, we finally figured out where the Capienna thing was, and I hope you guys are having as much fun as I am.